Hi guys, once again welcome back to Digital Perspective. In today's video, I am going to show you how to create this landing page, moon rotation and sparkling button animation. So let's start it. First of all, I am going to create a frame. So here I am selecting MacBook Air frame. Then I would add background image. So here I am opening Unsplash plugin. It's opening guys. Then I would search black space. After that, I would select this image. It's turned on perfect. Now I would reduce the opacity of this image. So I'll go to fill image and reduce the opacity to 50%. Also change the background color to black. Now we need to create headers. So I'll take this down. Then select X tool and write home. And here I have pockets, medium and size would be 6, perfect. Now select the text and press shift A to auto layout. Then control D to duplicate it and change the text to menu. Again duplicate it and change text to about. Again duplicate it and change the text to contact. Perfect. Then again duplicate it. This will be our button. So when I'm writing logging and I would select this, then go to stroke, change the color to white. Stroke pixel would be 1.5 pixel. Add round corners, 8 pixel. Then horizontal padding would be 24 pixel and vertical padding will be 8 pixel. Perfect. Now select these four menus and press shift A. To auto layout and change the this gap between 24 pixel center align it then we need one logo so here i will use iconify plugin i would search space then i would select this image perfect so i'll drag this here i will change its size to 44 pixel Then select all, center line and press shift A to auto layout. Perfect. Now, I would add top padding 40 pixels. Then I'll drag this into the frame. I hope it's good. I will change the gap between 200. Yes. So here we are done with the headers. Now we need to write uh, heading and sub heading. So I'll zoom in. Now select text tool and write text. Here I'm writing learning is easy with us. Then duplicate the text and this will be our sub adding. So here I'm writing we went beyond what was possible for design. Perfect. So First, our heading will be, I would change the font. Then here I'm selecting Quarantina. Font size will be 100 pixel. Perfect. And then our sub heading will be Poppins, semi bold. Font size will be 18 pixel. Perfect. Center align it. And then align it properly. Select both the text and take it up. Perfect. Now we need to create our CTA button. So I'll select text. I will write explore. I'll change the font to medium. Font size will be 18. Perfect. Then press shift A to auto layout and fill. Change the font text color to black. Select the frame. Horizontal padding will be 34 and vertical padding will be 14 also round the corners to 8 pixels perfect now center line it and take it above perfect so here we are completed with the landing page design now we need to create moon rotation design so i'll go to second page i will bring my png image and paste it here perfect now convert this image to frame right click and click on frame selection then select the frame and click on component and add a new variant 
then select moon image and rotate it to 30 degree then again add new variant select the moon and rotate it to 30 degree again add a new variant and rotate the moon image to 30 degree perfect I zoom out and select the component go to prototype then select the first frame select drag it to the second frame change on click to after delay 1ms smart animate and linear and 300 to 3000 perfect and select second frame drag to third frame on click to after delay 1ms smart animate linear and 3000 ms perfect select third frame drag to fourth frame on click to after delay 1ms perfect select fourth frame drag to first frame on click to after delay select 1ms perfect then select the first component first frame press alt and drag it outside to duplicate it then bring this moon image inside the frame and center line it now i would take this down 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 perfect now let's preview it it's working perfectly or not so guys it's working perfectly so here we are done with the moon rotation now we need to create sparkling button so let's start it now i'm going to bring star vectors so here i have already i'll copy it and i would paste it here perfect zoom in first of all we need to convert it into the frame so right click and frame selection then duplicate it two times like this perfect now go to first frame select the stars and reduce its opacity to zero then go to second frame and select all the stars and take it up one two three four five perfect then go to third frame and select all the stars take it up one two three four five now change its position and size so here i'll increase its size i'll rotate it perfect this one also this one this one also perfect then select all the frames and create a component set then select the component and uncheck the clipping content perfect then select the first frame and go shift to prototype and drag first frame to second frame then on click to mouse enter then smart animate is in and duration will be 200 ms Perfect. then select second frame and drag to third frame then after DA 1ms smart animate is in is out sorry is out then 200ms perfect then select third frame and drag to first frame on click to after delay 1ms smart animate to instant perfect after that shift to design and select first frame and duplicate it and control x to cut it then go to your cta button then i would paste my frame here and click on absolute position then align it properly zoom in then duplicate the frame multiple times until it's fill the whole button so here i'm doing select all the frame then alt again perfect now let's play it so as you all can see it's working perfectly the sparkle button and the moon rotation so it's done guys hope you have enjoyed and be sure to get that like and subscribe button if you haven't and also hit the bell icon for more such like updates meet you in the next video